Hey everyone, it is Havo High here, bringing another video on Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle. In this video, we're going to be breaking down the news for the Part 1 Christmas Celebration on Global. So with that, if you are new to my channel, like, subscribe, comment below, do all that good stuff. We're trying to hit 50,000 by the end of the year. Hopefully you can help with that. And always a shout out to DBZ Space and the Dokkan Wiki for images provided. Let's go ahead and jump into all the discussion and the news here. So in your box, actually, we ended up getting a couple of things already. So we actually do have a Santa Goku. A lot of people were thinking that this possibly could have been a usable unit, but it is just another Elder Kai. So it just increases super attack and uh, that's already in your box. But here's what we wanna take a look at. We wanna take a look at the Merry Christmas campaign and this is part one. They're gonna keep a tight lip to this. And just like I mentioned before that, you know, with this whole leaking of the Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken coming out uh, so early that I don't think that it's gonna be the Christmas banner and it doesn't look like it. So there is gonna be a part two to this and we'll talk all about that in just a second. So this is the Full of Wonders Merry Christmas campaign part one. And uh, various Christmas uh, events are here. Um, obtain the new wallpaper, a ton of dragon stones, legendary challenge campaign, which is great there. And of course, the new SSR Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken is debuting uh, as a global first. And then we're going to get a new story event. And of course, the 14th uh, virtual uh, ultimate clash that we're kind of waiting for. So let's go ahead and break this down here. So this runs from now until the 31st. So New Year's should be uh, a brand new celebration on literally the first there. So Wednesday the first or actually 31st we'll find out some new information. So this is a long, long celebration. And uh, so this is the, uh, the special bonuses there. Here is the Dragon Stones, which only last until the 18th which means part two should drop on the 18th usually you know they want to have you reload on some dragon stones by then so this one is pretty basic nothing too special just your five on the 20 uh 20 percent discount on the 91 a 50 percent and a and a six and that's it that's it's not much so i would think there's going to be a super dragon stone sale on the 18th so if you guys want to wait for that that's fine uh but you guys gotta have some stones to summon on this guy right here. This is the Dokkan Festival banner, which is dropping tonight. And this will run until the 31st, but like I said, this is such a early banner that I really think there's gonna be something, of course, put in uh, right before Christmas, and the 18th should be uh, where the information we should get for uh, part two. So, uh, so definitely look out for that. Now, a lot of people are saying, well, who's gonna be on the banner? Well, here's Hit. After one year, <laughs> one year that was introduced on Global, Hit finally returns on a banner. And I think he's going to be on a lot of banners upcoming because you have the Int, uh, you know, um, uh, dual category uh, support feature Gohan, the transforming Gohan. Uh, he's was on that banner. So I think he's going to be on a lot of different banners coming up there. So uh, Universe Survival Saga category, of course, that's going to be a given there. This is going to be the Christmas Select. Now, finally, we get to uh, pick up uh, Int Janemba. If you don't have them, pick them up with this Red Dragon Stone here. Uh, this is going to be the new uh, Dokkan Festival event there. Uh, I, I hope they make it somewhat difficult or somewhat challenging, I guess. I don't know. Uh, we'll see how that goes. So Warriors of Universe 6 uh, assembled. This is the new story event. We can pick up the Whis, the Champa, uh, the Hit, all those units there that are free to play. And uh, I'm going to talk a little bit more about this in just one second. The reason why this event is coming or the story event here. Then we have a Legendary Challenge campaign, which is great. I've already completed it, but for those who haven't completed the Vegeta yet, um, uh, this will give you some uh, nice rewards. And this is also going to run till the 5th, so quite some time. This right here is very interesting. It's actually running until 114, so I'm guessing the New Year celebration is going to be from the 31st to the 14th, and they're going to have something special for the New Year's as well. So this is the Virtual uh, Ultimate Clash here, so I think this is where the Jiren is introduced. So, uh, so we'll see who the enemies are and the characters are there now. We have all these Universal 6 Saga, Universal Survival Saga, all this stuff is returning, so that is great there. And uh, and then that's all they're gonna give us here. We got you know we got uh, triple success on training. Some um, uh, all hidden uh, potential events are open. Um, 
on there and then golden weekend missions return so this is you know no surprise they're just gonna kind of throw some free stuff at us but uh who yeah i don't you know this is just free stuff so you know take it as it goes and that's all they gave us that is all they gave us for part one they're being sneaky about this like i mentioned before on the 18th is what i'm what i'm gonna guess here since the dragonstone sale is going to end there we should get a part two and going back to this story mode here the arrival of Kale and Khalifla has to happen, all right? Has to happen. And a lot of you guys call uh, that LR, LR KFC. I call it Extra Crispy. So LR Extra, Extra Crispy needs to arrive because, man, we've been dying for that unit. And this will make just total sense because it will work on a Universal Survival Saga uh, team. And uh, it just fits nicely. So hopefully that is going to be the case. Uh, that we are going to get LR Kelly and Khalifla. But this is the Merry Christmas Campaign Part 1. Like I said, very secretive in what they're trying to provide us. And we don't, ha and I don't see the Thank You Celebration banner either. And I think we'll get that as well. Um, which we should have gotten one already. So, And I think the reason why they don't want to do that is they're trying to wait on you know giving us the opportunity to purchase the LR Go Bros with uh, with the red coins. So unfortunately, you guys look like you might have to wait just a little while longer. But uh, I think that will drop uh, pretty soon. So anyway, tell me what you guys think in the comment section below. This is part one of the Merry Christmas uh, campaign. And uh, are you guys ex excited? Uh, we already knew about Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken. Uh, but now you got to wait a little bit more for part two, which I think it's going to be Kaelin Khalifla, possibly the uh, Thank You Tanabata banner. And then maybe something even more spectacular because they got to make up for last year's hit uh, banner uh, when, it, when it came for Christmas. So with that, thank you guys for watching. And uh, if you are new to my channel, like, subscribe, comment below, do all that good stuff. And uh, yeah, Whew, that is the news. So uh, keep on Dokani. We'll catch you next time. Later.